Question. Question. Did you know what types of prisoners were classified to be detained in the common room and in the individual cells? Uh, and selon in which buildings were the common rooms located? And what about the individual cells? Response. Réponse. As I observed during my coming and going there, the individual, individual cells where all the common rooms, the common rooms were for Pardon, the detention of those who were not having the senior or high-ranking officers. Rang and they would be detained in the common rooms or on the upper floor. And for the prisoners whose confessions had to be extracted, they would be placed in the individual cells. Questioned. The common rooms, in which buildings were the common rooms located? Response from my experience in taking the prisoners, the common rooms were in building B, C, and D on the upper floors. Question. Question. What about the individual cells? Which building Et were they located in? Individuelles se trouvaient dans quel bâtiment? Réponse. Response. The individual cells individuelles were in those buildings that I just described, but they were on the ground floor <coughs> and on the first floor. Mais au rez de chaussée et au premier étage. Question. In the Question. common rooms. Dans les cellules. How commune. the prisoners were Comment detained? Les were the prisoners shackled in the common rooms? Tenus. Étaient-ils immobilisés par des entraves? Question: From what I observed, Réponse. the prisoners were shackled in a long bar. Et il y avait des there were roughly ten prisoners in each bar. À peu près dix personnes par uh, bar. Question: In the common rooms, Question. how many Dans prisoners were detained? Combien pouvait-il y avoir de prisonniers? Response: Réponse. From what I saw, there were less vu, than 20 prisoners in each common room because, according to the serial number in each room, the number ranged from 1 to 18. Les Question: In each bar, how many prisoners Question. were shackled? Combien de personnes étaient entravées sur Response: bar. On one side, Réponse. on the bar, nine prisoners bar, were shackled. Personnes. Question: How many bars Question. then in each Et common room? Combien de bars pouvait-il y avoir dans une salle commune? Response: Réponse. In the common rooms, there were two Les bars in each room. Les salles communes avaient deux bars chacune. Question: What were Question. the prisoners required to do? Whether Les they were asked to sit or stand? Response: ce, ce When I saw the prisoners were lying on the floor, 
They were lying réponse, in lorsque j'ai rows. ce que j'ai vu c'est que les prisonniers étaient couchés sur le sol en rangée question what clothes were the prisoners wearing when you saw them response réponse some of them Certains were wearing shorts and some short. of them were topless d'autres n'avaient pas de chemise Question. Did you mean some of the prisoners were Question. Vous voulez naked? dire que certains étaient tout nus? Response. Yes. Réponse. Oui. Question. Question. What did you know about the food ration to the Quand prisoners? Saviez-vous des rations alimentaires servies aux prisonniers? Response. Réponse. The food which was provided which was provided to the prisoners fourni aux prisonniers were in a form of gruel with the banana stock. And I didn't know much about this because I did not uh, do it personally. Je ne savais pas grand-chose à ce sujet puisque je ne participais pas directement. Questions in hygiene. Dans cette How did the prisoners wash themselves? Comment les prisonniers se lavaient-ils? Question. Réponse. They washed in the. Ils se Common room as the guard would host them down every two to three days. Garde les aspergés d'eau, les arrosait à partir d'un tuyau d'arrosage à peu près tous les deux ou trois jours. Question. Did you notice if any prisoner was sick in the common room? Des prisonniers malades dans les salles communes. Response. Réponse. I did not notice or see any sick prisoner. Fais attention. En tout cas, je n'ai pas remarqué de prisonnier malade. Question. Question. Did you see any medic providing treatment to the prisoners at the detention facility? Des prisonniers en détention. Response. Réponse. The medics. Le provided the treatment to the prisoners at the detention facilities, yes, the medics oui. walked around to see those prisoners and sometimes they dispensed the medicine, the pellets, the rabbit pellet uh, uh, medicine to them. Questions for those prisoners who were interrogated and tortured and they were wounded or injured, were they taken back into the same common rooms? Yes, they were taken back. Answered. Questioned. And were they treated for their wounds after they were tortured? Response. Yes, they were treated in their rooms. Réponse. Oui, ils étaient traités dans les cellules. Question. Question. What about the individual cells? Qu'en est-il des the cellules individuelles? Est-ce in que les prisonniers étaient entravés And dans so, ces cellules-là? How they were shackled or cast? Et s'ils l'étaient, comment étaient-ils entravés? Response. Y avait-il aussi des menottes? In the Réponse. individual cells, dans les cellules individuelles, were les prisonniers étaient entravés on ankle, par la cheville, or they were chained to a metal post a in that room. Question, were both feet Question. circled or just one foot? Response, ben mostly I noticed only one foot was circled. Vu qu'on entravait qu'un seul pied. Question, Question, were the prisoners required to lie down in the individual cells as those in the common rooms? Les cellules individuelles, comme c'était le cas dans les cellules Response, communes. Response, yes. They lied down oui. on the floor. They were not allowed to sol, sit or stand. They were not allowed to sit or stand. Question. What about the female prisoners? Where Les were they detained? Les détenues femmes. Où étaient-elles détenues? 
Réponse. Female prisoners les prisonnières were detained. étaient détenues. Some of them were detained in the individual cells. En cellule individuelle. But the majority of Mais them were detained on the upper floor, which were the large common rooms, and they were not circled or cuffed. Ni entravées, ni they were only locked from outside. On verrouillait simplement la porte de l'extérieur. Question. The children who Question. came along with the mothers were they detained in the same rooms as their mothers, or were they detained separately? Response. I did not see any children Je in there. Je n'ai pas vu d'enfants dans les cellules des femmes. Question. Question. What about the Westerners? Which building were they detained and were they circled or cuffed? Response. Response. The Westerners whom I saw, they were detained at the corner on the upper staircase. They were detained in the open on the upper staircase. En haut de l'escalier. Question. Question. Were those foreigners circled or cuffed? Ces étrangers portaient les menottes et les entraves. Response. When I saw them, they were circled as the rest of the prisoners. Oui, ils étaient entravés comme tous les autres. Question. What about their Question. clothing? Et comment étaient-ils habillés? Response. Réponse. They wore their clothes. Ils avaient leurs propres vêtements. Question. Question. Were they dressed the same way as those Ils local prisoners? Ils étaient habillés comme I mean, les prisonniers cambodgiens, c'est-à-dire avec euh, juste un short. Response. The Westerners whom I saw, voir, they wore the same dress that they wore when they were brought in. Les vêtements qu'ils avaient sur le dos lors de leur incarcération. Question. Question. What about the food ration Et for these foreigners? La nourriture des étrangers. Response. Réponse. I did not know it clearly, je but I think the food ration was the same as those provided to the fille, other prisoners. There was no difference. La ration pour eux était la même que pour les autres prisonniers. Question: What about the Question. Vietnamese prisoners of war? Where were they detained? De guerre, Ils étaient détenus où? Response: Réponse. I did not know clearly, je but they were detained. Within the three buildings, en tout cas, ils I was étaient just not sure which building they were detained in. Dans l'un ou l'autre de, des trois bâtiments, mais je ne saurais pas dire Question. dans lequel. Were they Question. also detained, Eux aussi handcuffed or circles, and what about the dress? Notés en travée, et par ailleurs, Response. comment étaient-ils habillés? In Réponse. general, they were circled as the en rest général, of the prisoners. Ils étaient comme tous les autres. Some regarding the dress, some of them wore the clothes, and some did not. Habillé, d'autres pas. Question. Question. Did you know the total number of the prisoners of war who were detained there in S21? total de prisonniers de guerre détenus à S21? Response: I Réponse. cannot provide the total je number as I did not know the figure. Total. Je, ne, je ne sais pas quel pourrait être ce chiffre. Question. Regarding the S21 staff who were detained, Quant where were they detained? Quant au personnel de S21 mis en détention, où étaient-ils mis en détention? The Réponse. The S21 staff, I saw them de detained je les ai vus in the building. Dans But the, we, the interrogators, were not allowed to go nous, near them. Mais nous, n'avions pas le droit and de nous approcher de là. Et la salle où ils étaient closed. incarcérés so était all the windows and doors were euh, all shut. complètement fermée, bloquée. Les issues étaient obscurcies. Les fenêtres et les portes étaient euh, obscurcies. Question. 
question. Question. Regarding the prisoners who needed to relieve themselves, what would happen? I talk about those who were detained in the common room. Se faire leurs besoins. Ceux qui étaient dans les cellules communes. Response. Comment faisaient-ils réponse? I did not stationed there permanently, so I was not that sure. Pas là de manière permanente, Maybe je ne suis pas for très sûr. a prisoner who needed to relieve himself would need to sit up and do it on the oh, ammunition box. S'asseoir et s'asseoir sur une sur une des, des vieilles boîtes à munitions. Question. Question. The prisoners who were detained at S21, were there any of them released? Response. Since the time I started working there until the time I left, I did not see any prisoner released. Question. If no prisoner was released, Aucun what was the fate of those who were detained there? Quel était le sort qui Response. était réservé the fate of all aux prisonniers? Réponse: Tous les prisonniers. D'après ce que je j'ai pu observer, tous les prisonniers devaient mourir. Question: Were they killed or did Question, they die naturally? Étaient-ils tués ou bien? Mourrait-il de mort naturelle Réponse. Some died due to their sickness inside the cells or the rooms, and some were taken and killed. D'autres étaient emmenés pour être exécutés. Did you ever see Question. any prisoner commit suicide? Jamais vu un cas de prisonnier qui se soit suicidé. Response. Réponse. I never saw any prisoner non. commit any suicide, vu de cas de but suicide. I heard uh, there mais were some prisoners who committed suicide. Entendu parler. Question: How Question. the prisoners commit suicide? Les prisonniers qui se sont suicidés s'y sont pris comment? Response. Réponse. I heard only after I went to the study dire, session at the political school ça, near Dutch House, we were told some of them jumped Dutch. from the On building, and some burned themselves with the, se sont brûlés with the lamp, à lampe, and some used a pen to prick themselves to die. Question: Did you know the total number of the prisoners who Question. committed suicide? Avez-vous connaissance du nombre total de Response. détenus qui se sont suicidés? Réponse: Non, je ne sais pas. Question. The teenies who were executed at S21, what time of the day would they be executed there? Response. Normally, the teenies would be taken in the late afternoon and uh, at dusk. When I saw the trucks would be parked somewhere near the compound, and their detainees would be loaded on the trucks to be taken away. Question: Were there detainees killed at S21? Response. At uh, S21 compound, uh, detainees would also be 
exécutés et buried dans le compound et dans la location in the surrounding area dans le complexe Question, et dans la zone environnante what, what kind of detainees Quel were executed and buried in the surrounding area of S21 dans le Response. dans la zone de S21 I am not sure but uh, while I was on je guard sûr, picking some coconut fruits Then I noted uh, the graves uh, uh, with a lot of flies and smell. Question, do you know which group was assigned to take prisoners to be executed? Response, I don't know. Question, was it Hum Hoi's group in charge of transporting detainees? Response, I don't know whether Hum Hoi's group or Peng's group. Question. Where would uh, the important detainees be executed? Where would execute the detainees important? Response. Response. I don't know. Je ne sais pas. Question. Question. Where would uh, the member of staff at S21 and their spouses execute? Où exécutait-on les membres du personnel de S21 Respond. et leurs conjoints I don't know. Réponse, je ne sais pas. Question. Question. Where were the Westerners executed and how? Où a-t-on exécuté les Occidentaux et de quelle manière? Response. Réponse. I'm not sure if I know this, but I was told sûr, of about this. I was told dit, that they were killed at the tués. corner of uh, the road links to Moha Montrey Pagoda and Mohamed I was told uh, that uh, the detainees were put uh, on the street and burned using car tires. Question. Question. When you heard about this was the detainees alive or dead while they were being burned response I did not uh, witness it but uh, the detainees uh, were sitting so I believe they could have been alive while they were being burned uh, question who told you about this Question, qui vous a dit cela? Response. Réponse. Sir, the former sûr, guard from Kampung Chnang told Kampung me Chnang. about this. Question. Question. Were they executed in the day or at night? Est-ce qu'ils ont été tués de jour ou de nuit? Response. 
I don't réponse, know. Je ne sais pas. Question. Question. Where were the Vietnamese prisoners of war and Vietnamese prisoners were executed? Où est-ce qu'on exécutait les prisonniers de guerre vietnamiens et les prisonniers vietnamiens de façon générale? Response. Réponse. I did not witness any killing at uh, S21 of these uh, detainees, so I presume that they could have been executed at Chiang Ek. Question, how many Vietnamese prisoners of war would have been killed if you can give us the approximate uh, figure? Response, I cannot uh, give you the approximate uh, figure of uh, those detainees, uh, and I am afraid I cannot make even a guess. Question, can you Question. Uh, agree that there were about hundreds of them? Response, yes, I do agree with that. Plusieurs centaines? Question, Réponse do you know where the children Question. were killed? Réponse. Uh, uh, falling on the ground, and that's one incident I witnessed, and that's all. Le seul Question. When detainees were transferred to be executed at Chiang Ai, do you know anything about this? Response. When I worked at S21, Donc, I did not know S21, that Chung Ek existed. Uh, I learned that the detainees would Ek. be taken out, je but to where they would be taken, I mm. have no idea. Question. Question. Do you know anything about the operation of the transportation of detainees to be executed at Chiang Ek? Opérations de transport des prisonniers vers Chiang Ek. Response: No, I don't. No. Question. How would uh, detainees be executed at S21? Comment exécutait-on les détenus à S21? Response. Réponse. When it comes to execution, I think I don't know much about it because I was not at the place where people were executed. Je ne me trouvais pas à l'endroit où ces exécutions avaient lieu. Question. One day Question. before the 7th of January 1979, were there any prisoners left at S21? Response. Réponse. I don't know what happened inside the prison, but at that time, a, a few days before that, uh, we were allowed to break, to have a break. On nous a Question. Une pause. You were allowed to Question. be off duty. What about the other people? Vous what were they doing back then? Service, mais que les à ce 
response. I don't know anything about the other people's work, but for the interrogations units uh, or sessions, uh, people were off duty and were put idle because uh, we heard that the Vietnamese uh, were approaching and everyone were so worried and uh, be prepared to react if necessary. Question, when did you leave S21? Response, it was on the 7th of January 1979 at about 9 or 10 a.m. when we saw the uh, tanks uh, approaching on Moni Wong Boulevard, Ho shouted to us to seize our weapons and fled to the direction of Tul Tumpung Market and further. Question, when you Question. left uh, 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 the, at the moment when you were leaving, did you see any detainees left in Building A? Response. I don't think I saw any detainee there because I left uh, a few days. I, I left the building without noting it. Je suis parti sans rien remarquer. Question. Question. Do you know who made the decision to kill those people? De tuer ces Response. Response. I don't know. Non, je ne sais pas. Question. Question. Can you just, to the best of your knowledge, tell Quand the court that you know who made such si decision? Savez qui a pris cette décision? Response. Réponse. I don't know. When I left, uh, I did not Je even know that there were any prisoners left behind. Question. Question. Can you give us a proximate uh, figure of the detainees who would have been killed at S21? Qui ont pu être tués à S21. Response. Réponse. If my estimation is correct, uh, uh, there were no less than 20,000 detainees put to death there. Au total. Question. Question. Do you know where Ho, the deputy chief of S21, lived? Response. No, I don't. I don't even know whether he is alive or dead. Question. When you left Phnom Penh, was Ho in your company? Or se trouvait avec vous. Response. Réponse. Ho, Dutch, Or, Chan, Chan, and others were leaving all together. Sont partis tous ensemble. Question. Question. Were there any detainees being brought along with your group? Des détenus. Response. There were. Réponse. Chumay, Il y avait Chumay, Wanat, Wanat, Tun, Tun, Ming, Ming. I think a few of them already died, but they were going morts, along with us on the move while we were, were leaving. Dans notre fuite. Mr. Yazakon, I have no further questions Yazakon, for the time being. The president uh, judges up the bench. Uh, would you wish to put juge. any questions to the witness? The floor is témoin. yours. Judge uh, Silver Cartwright, you take the floor. Thank you, Mr. President. 
You have spoken today uh, about foreigners who were detained at S21, and I just want to ask you a few more questions about them. Do you recall foreigners other than Vietnamese or Westerners being detained at S21? But response. I only saw the Vietnamese prisoners and the Westerners, the two Westerners. I did not see other foreigners. Did you see any Thai detainees? Response. No, I didn't. No. While you were at S21, did you hear any reports on the radio or by other means of armed conflict with any other country? Response. At S21, I learned that there was a armed conflict between Vietnam and Cambodia. Can you recall when this conflict started or when you first learned of it? Response. I learned uh, of it through the interrogation session when detainees uh, said uh, they were sent uh, to the battles to fight uh, the Vietnamese, and I heard about this in 1977. Was 1977 the first year when you recall Vietnamese prisoners of war at S21? Response, could you please repeat your question? Was 1977 the first year that you saw Vietnamese prisoners of war detained at S21? But Response, yes. Response, oui. Did you see other Vietnamese detained at S21, ordinary Vietnamese people who were not soldiers? Response. There were Vietnamese soldiers as well as ordinary Vietnamese detainees. They were mixed up. You said before in answer to Judge Yasokan that you agreed there would be hundreds of Vietnamese at S21. Were there as many ordinary Vietnamese as Vietnamese prisoners of war, or were there more prisoners of war than ordinary people? Response. What I saw was that there were more soldiers, Vietnamese soldiers, than ordinary Vietnamese detainees. You spoke earlier today of an incident when you saw a woman being electrocuted. Do you recall that incident? Response. 
Response. I still remember oui, some of the incident. And you were Question. on guard at the time. Is that correct? Je garde ce jour-là. Est-ce exact? Response. Yes, there is. Response. Oui. Can you describe Question. exactly que what you saw from where you were standing de on guard? Response. I was standing on guard in the front and I could hear the interrogation session by Tet and Chan and Boo. Although I was standing guard outside, de faction à I could hear mais something about their confession and I could see that the, the detainee was electrocuted je, pu voir and tortured. Que Can you explain how you could see her being electrocuted? Were you looking through a window? Were you simply hearing the sounds of electrocution? Or was there some other way you, you um, observed this? Response. When I was standing guard, there was a slight door of the apartment, so I could see well deep inside of the room. Une porte, uh, qui sur la pièce Is it correct that at an earlier interview, you said Question. that it was the accused, Doik, who administered the electric shock to the woman? But no, no, I'm long, long. Response. Response. Yes, during that time, Deutsche was oui, donc, uh, the chairman, although he did not uh, carry out uh, that torture, but Bu was present, and I don't Boo know whether uh, Bu was uh, verbally instructed or ordered, because I could si hardly hear what they were talking inside the room while I was outside. So you're saying that you could hear everything clearly and you could see into the room and today you confirm that it was Dick Boo who did the electrocution of this woman. Is that correct? Response. Yes, that is correct that Dag Boo, oui, uh, Dag Boo were taught, was torturing the detainee. Sometime I could hear their conversation, but sometime I didn't uh, because I was about five, four to five meters apart from uh, that uh, room of the, uh, in the apartment. De la pièce dans would it be fair to say that you have thought a great deal about your experiences as a guard at S21 uh, over the last 30 years? Response, I think I cannot Response. catch your question yet. I'm sorry. Have you thought often about the time you were a guard at S21 over the last 30 years? Response. I can read call some of the oui, events, but uh, I have forgotten lieu. most of Mais the significant part of my time during that regime. Beaucoup de ce que fait and 
Would it be true to say that you have been interviewed about your experiences a number of times and discussed them with a lot of people over the years? Is that fair? Response, yes, that is. And sometimes you remember exactly what you saw and heard, but other times, uh, just as you said earlier about the Westerners being killed, you have told us what other people told you. Is that correct? Respond, yes, there is. Earlier today, you said that you saw no pregnant women at the prison, but that you, but in an interview, an earlier interview, you have spoken of a pregnant woman giving birth at the prison. Was that something you heard about or something you observed yourself? When the judge asked me about the detainee, I responded differently. But uh, I saw a woman named Ton who was uh, from China, and I did not know what happened that she was arrested. And then she was allowed to treat detainees uh, at that location. And when I got uh, sick, because I got the numbness, just uh, the whole part of uh, uh, one side of my body, and uh, I was uh, hospitalized, and uh, Medic uh, Thorn was asked uh, to cure me, but uh, she was a detainee, but she was allowed to go about or to move about outside the premises of the prison. Well, I don't think I explained my question clearly to you. In an earlier interview, and the ERN reference in English is 00161558, you said, as for anyone being pregnant, I never saw that. I just know there were some pregnant prisoners in the prison. Two or three months later, they released her, meaning no shackles. When she gave birth, it was a boy. Do you recall making that answer in an earlier interview? Response, Réponse. I seemed not to recall it. Non, je ne crois pas me souvenir. So today, Question. you can't confirm donc, that incident. Is that incident. correct? Yes, bien exact. Response, yes. Oui, effectivement. Finally, I want to ask you about the last days at S21. You have said today that you left uh, 
on the 7th of January when tanks were seen on Monivong Boulevard and Hoare ordered you to leave. Is that correct? Response, yes, that is correct. Can you remember what day before that day was the last time you guarded any prisoners? Response, I cannot catch the question. Can you please rephrase it? Were you still guarding prisoners on the 7th of January, or had they all gone by then? Response. Regarding the prisoners, before three or four days before the 7th January, we did not make any movement, and it was quiet. Were there no prisoners left at S21 for those three or four days before the 7th of January? Response, yes. You mean, yes, there were no prisoners, is that correct? Il n'y avait pas de prisonniers? Oui, il y avait des prisonniers. Response. Yes, there were no prisoners. Did you see what happened to the last prisoners before the 7th of January? Response. What happened happened before the 7th January, and I did not see any much activities. The activities before were the prisoners were trapped out, and then everything went dead for three or four days before the 7th of January, because before that, the prisoners were trapped out day and night. Avant cela, les prisonniers ont été emportés en camion jour et nuit. Yes, thank you very much. Uh, and uh, can I say I appreciate you trying so hard to remember details. Uh, Mr. President, I have no other questions. The President, the Judges of the Bench, do you have any questions? Judge Lavange, you take the floor. Oui, merci, Monsieur le Président. Bonsoir, Judge Monsieur. Laverne. Je suis le juge Laverne. J'ai quelques you, questions à vous poser pour essayer de clarifier certains points de votre déposition. Tout d'abord, vous nous avez expliqué que vous avez rejoint la Révolution aux alentours de l'année 1973. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous dire quelle était votre, euh, quelles études vous aviez fait Jusqu'où étiez-vous allé en classe Je suis allé en classe. Avant la révolution en 1973, j'ai étudié jusqu'à la 8e classe de l'ancien système éducatif. C'est-à-dire, vous saviez lire, écrire en, en Khmer. Est-ce que vous saviez également euh, parler un petit peu français et lire en français ou écrire en français when I studied, I could read and Et write a little bit of French, but now I forget it all. Avant de rejoindre euh, la révolution, quelle était Before votre activité? Revolution, what did your activities consist in? Qu'est-ce que vous faisiez?
Before I joined the revolution, I was in school, and after the coup d'état, I quit schooling and I helped my parents in rice farming. J'ai arrêté ma scolarisation et j'ai aidé mes parents riziculteurs. En ce qui concerne Question. vos activités à S21, Regarding your activities in S21, vous avez travaillé à l'ancienne PJ ou est-ce que l'ancien euh, commissariat de la police judiciaire ou est-ce que vous n'avez travaillé que à euh, l'actuel musée de Tuolsling not know the location or worked je at the PJ prison. Pas les lieux. Je pas When I came à la to work, I worked Lorsque at the S21 location. Est-ce que vous aviez Question. entendu parler d'une prison à Takmao? Did you ever hear about a prison in Takmao? Réponse. I did not go or see the prison in Takmao, but later on, those people who used to work there told me that there was a prison in Takmao, but I, I myself never went there. J'ai retenu de vos Question. explications que votre première activité à S21 était une activité de garde à l'extérieur des bâtiments. Vous pouvez nous rappeler exactement quand, quand précisément vous avez commencé cette activité, si vous vous en souvenez Réponse. Guarding outside, or when I was assigned to stand guard outside, I could not recall it. First, I did the rice farming en fait, in Prisau, and I worked there for one season, and after the harvest, I was sent to stand guard, so I could not recall the exact month. Alors, je ne me souviens pas exactement dans quel mois ça s'est passé. Une saison agricole, c'est une année, c'est plusieurs mois, qu'est-ce que c'est une saison agricole What is a season? Is it one year? Is it several months? Could you define it, please? Response. Réponse. When I worked in the rice field, it was from the beginning of the year until the end of the year. Début de l'année. I started from the time that I had to use the hole to dig the ground, then we had to transplant the seedlings until the whole season complete, that is, towards the end when we harvested the rice. C'est-à-dire jusqu'au temps de la récolte. Et la récolte a eu lieu quand En janvier And when did the harvest en avril. take place? In January? In April? Response in Cambodia. November or December? November or December? Or January or February? That's the harvest season. Ou bien en janvier ou en février. C'est ça la saison de la récolte. Donc on a un éventail entre novembre so et février. A time span from November to February, is that it? Well, response. Réponse. I think I'm not really sure. It's been so long. I cannot recollect it. J'ai du mal à But me souvenir general, du moment exact. As it is the practice now, it also depends on the rain. 
Sometimes we started in June or July. Sometimes we started early or later, and usually we finish around November or December. Et on, ou bien on finissait plus, ou, ou bien plus tard. Je veux dire, les dates euh, sont, sont un peu variables. Mais en général, on récoltait vers novembre ou décembre. Votre activité de Question. gardien à l'extérieur de S21, elle dure pendant combien de temps exactement Si vous pouvez vous en souvenir. S21, Un mois Deux mois remember, Plusieurs mois Was it one month Two months Several months. Response. Réponse. The time that I stood guard outside, I could not recall how many months, but it was a pretty long. Bien de mois, mais c'était une période relativement longue. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez qui vous a dit? que vous allez changer d'affectation, que vous allez changer de, de, de poste. Comment ça s'est passé Qui est-ce qui vous a dit de, de quitter vos fonctions pour en prendre d'autres Réponse. From what I know, Although it's been so long already, and I might not remember it well, I think it was Ho who told me, but I'm not really sure. So I cannot clearly say who actually told me. Qui m'a donné la nouvelle affectation? Et Or, vous le connaissiez depuis longtemps? Or, had you known Ho for a long time? Response. I knew Ho when I came to work at S21. Que j'avais commencé à travailler à S21. Est-ce que vous l'aviez rencontré à la 703e division? Did you meet him at the 703rd division? Response. I did not know him at the division 703. I met him at S21. Quelle était votre activité exacte à la 703e division? What did you do exactly when you were in division 703? Response. At Division 703, during the war time, I was in the artillery unit in the battalion 48. I was in charge of an artillery. Quand vous avez changé de fonction, vous vous êtes retrouvé when you change si your duties, ce if matin, I understood correctly what you said this morning, you became a guard inside S21. Aussitôt, vous avez eu aussi Were you then immediately assigned to work as an interrogator? Des fonctions de gardien so et d'interrogateur, ou est-ce que ce sont des fonctions que vous avez exercées successivement? Or did you work l'une après l'autre ou les deux en même temps réponse I was assigned from après avoir été working outside I was assigned to work inside and vers l'intérieur I was assigned to interrogate the prisoners. I was not assigned to guard inside at all. Je n'étais pas à être garde intérieur du tout. Donc, vous n'avez jamais Question. effectué de tour de garde à so l'intérieur de S21. So, you never did guard duty inside S21. Is that correct? Response. Yes, I never got it inside. Je n'étais jamais garde à l'intérieur. 
Alors, je dois avouer que je ne comprends pas très bien, parce que, me semble-t-il tout à l'heure, lorsque euh, mes collègues vous ont interrogé sur un incident, et ça, un incident, concernant l'interrogatoire d'une femme auquel Douk aurait participé, j'avais cru comprendre que vous aviez expliqué qu'à ce moment-là, vous, vous étiez à un poste de garde à l'extérieur de la cellule. The, the the cell. Alors, si vous n'étiez pas so, à un poste de garde, qu'est-ce que vous faisiez Vous étiez dans la cellule cell? Vous étiez là par hasard Were you there just by chance? Well, no. Response. À ce moment-là, j'étais un interrogateur. Après avoir fini, mais après, après 11 avoir fini, PM, and when après 11h du soir, un was brought for et interrogation, on a amené that un détenu asked me à to interroger, il m'a demandé d'aider. So I was only en faisant le garde that à l'extérieur de la salle. Event. Donc, je suis on, I was comme garde dans ce cas précis. En dehors de cela, je n'ai jamais eu de fonction de garde Be Because at that time there were no other guards for these late interrogation, and I was asked to assist, assist in providing the the guarding outside the interrogation room. Et donc on m'a demandé de 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 faire cela au pied levé. Vous aviez des contacts fréquents avec l'accusé Douk. Did you have frequent contact with the accused Quand vous étiez interrogateur When you were an interrogator. Réponse. Regarding the interrogation work. Pour ce qui est du travail d'interrogatoire, je devais être Because en I had to respond to him when he asked questions regarding the prisoners or the confessions. So et the contact was very Donc, le contact rather avec frequent. Lui était passablement fréquent. Alors, de quel type de contact s'agissait-il C'était so des contacts sort of contact was it? Euh, uniquement par l'intermédiaire de lettres comme vous l'avez expliqué. Est-ce que c'était des contacts visuels Est-ce qu'il y avait des rencontres entre vous et lui Ou est-ce que c'était d'autres formes de contacts Documents that I sent. Concernant les documents que je Sometimes faisais remonter, annotated parfois les documents étaient annotés documents par for me to redo it or afin to que je continue the interrogation. la procédure ou que je poursuive l'interrogatoire. Parfois, complete, lorsque l'interrogatoire n'était pas terminé, il me passait un coup de fil. Vous aviez souvent des contacts téléphoniques entre, euh, avec Duke. Contact with Duke. Et qu'est-ce qu'il vous disait C'était quel And type d'instructions so, il vous donnait What sort of instructions did he give you What did he say to you The telephone contact was contact not frequent. Était peu It happened occasionally. Il était seulement occasionnel. However, I cannot recall clearly Je the frequency of contact. Précisément It's la been so long already. Je ne m'en souviens pas, ça fait très longtemps. En quoi consistaient ces instructions Qu'est-ce qu'il qu disait What did he say What did his instructions consist of? Qu'est-ce qu'il vous demandait? What did he ask you? Response. Réponse. 
I cannot recall what his instructions were on the telephone, but usually he would want to follow the progress of the interrogations and certain follow-ups on the documents that I sent to him. Relative aux documents que j'avais fait remonter vers lui. Donc, est-ce que, par exemple, comme type d'instruction, il vous disait il faut interroger euh, pour savoir quelle est la personne dans le réseau ou quelles sont les personnes dans les réseaux de traite euh, Est-ce qu'il vous euh, donnait des indications sur la façon d'orienter l'interrogatoire ou est-ce qu'il donnait d'autres instructions Or did he give other instructions? The response, from what I can recall, usually his instructions focused on the, the leaders or the important prisoners in order to find the network of his subordinates or their subordinates. Usually that was his main focus. Est-ce qu'il donnait aussi des instructions concernant la manière d'interroger his instructions were not on every aspect, but previously, yes, during the study sessions, he already provided instructions on this matter. Alors, vous avez été entendu, monsieur, en tant que témoin par les enquêteurs du bureau des co-juges d'instruction. Votre interrogatoire figure à la cote D19-7. Je vois notamment à la page 20 en français, on vous pose cette question-là. Rappelez-vous, est-ce que vous vous rappelez quelles étaient les directives de Duke avant chaque interrogatoire Vous avez répondu ceci, Duke donnait ses directives lorsque c'était des prisonniers importants qu'on voudrait avoir la confession à tout prix dans ce genre de cas, il nous a instruits à questionner à fond pour savoir ces raisons. est-ce que vous confirmez ce que je viens de lire Et si c'est le cas, qu'est-ce que ça veut dire Questionner à fond pour voir ces raisons. If you understood what I have read out, what does it mean to say to question in depth to find out about the networks. Response. That means he wanted to follow the progress of that matter so that I had to really take the route to find the source of that prisoner to find the network. Est-ce que ça veut dire que pour creuser à la racine, comme vous dites, l'usage d'une certaine forme de violence était autorisé to dig to rightly to the Pour root verse, to get in depth the details of the confession en, en or to redo parts of the confession in order to find every detail of the matter. Alors, je vais être peut-être encore plus clair. Est-ce que vous avez reçu de Duc des instructions pour torturer des prisonniers, pour user de violence à l'égard de certains prisonniers 
on some prisoners. But there were continuing instructions regarding this matter when I attended the study session at a political school. He instructed us on the method of torturing and not letting the prisoner die. Otherwise, the confession would be broken. So the instructions were given continuously during those study sessions. Donc, lorsque vous recevez des instructions pour interroger à fond, questionner à fond, selon vous, ça veut dire qu'il faut appliquer toutes les directives que vous avez reçues pendant votre, pendant votre formation, y compris de recourir à certaines formes de violence Est-ce que ça veut dire ça pour vous Bad. Response. Yes. Réponse. Oui. Revenons à la formation. Now, let us to Vous nous training. avez dit que cette formation était notamment dispensée par l'accusé lui-même. Vous avez indiqué qu'il y avait différentes you sortes de formations. Il y avait des formations d'ordre politique. Et puis, il y avait également des formations qui And portaient sur les interrogatoires et les techniques d'interrogatoire. Ce qui m'intéresse maintenant sont effectivement les formations concernant so les techniques d'interrogatoire. Je que vous nous précisiez exactement like dans votre souvenir exactly quel était le contenu de ces formations. Et est-ce que ces formations comprenaient de la part de l'accusé lui-même des instructions quant à l'usage de certaines formes de violence himself. On the use of certain forms of violence. But Response. During the study sessions, mostly we were trained, we were provided a political training, technical training in making documents. Confection de documents and the torture techniques. La formation aux techniques de torture. Therefore, we were provided with Donc, trainings in all these areas. Nous avions une formation dans tous ces domaines. Alors, est-ce que vous pouvez être un peu Question. plus précis et nous dire exactement ce, ce que Duc vous a enseigné exactly quant aux techniques de torture, pour reprendre votre expression Qu'est-ce qui vous, qu qu vous a dit exactement what Quelles étaient exactly les formes de violence que l'on pouvait utiliser what were the forms of violence he said you could use? Il vous a parlé de quoi Il vous a parlé d'électrochocs. Il vous a parlé de l'usage de fouets, Did he tell you about using de l'usage de cannes, de canes, bâtons. Sticks. De quoi a-t-il parlé Est-ce que c'était lui personnellement ou est-ce que c'était quelqu'un qui parlait en sa présence Response. During the sessions, Deutsch was the one who gave lecture. We were trained not to use big clap to beat any detainee to avoid hurting the detainee until he or she 
died of the sustained uh, injury and uh, we were taught to insert a needle underneath the nails and uh, by doing so only the detainees could sustain from the wound at the in, in the fingers not uh, affecting the heart or the the legs uh, that the detainee could not walk uh, to work so this was a kind of torture that was light but painful Quand vous dites, on nous apprenait à mettre des aiguilles sous les ongles, on, c'est qui Response, it was a theory instructed to us by Deutsch, because it was the light uh, uh, torture technique that did not affect the heart of the detainee. C'est ce que Doug vous disait. Il vous disait que vous pouvez mettre des aiguilles sous les ongles parce que ça ne tuera pas le prisonnier. C'est ce qu'il vous disait. Response. Yes, that was because we were told to do this because we would like to make sure that detainees would not be killed by such torture. The president interrupts. Since it is time to take an adjournment, the chamber will adjourn for 17 minutes until 3.20 p.m. The court official is instructed to take the witness to the waiting room.